Hi, Sanidha. Good evening. Yeah, good evening, sir. Okay, so we know that uh, what is the purpose of this uh, meeting? Okay, so just uh, we are trying to uh, help the students who will appear uh, for the interview. Okay, uh, for 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 this year and for the next years also for MPP program. Okay, masters in public policy, right? So this interview, this interaction uh, will help others also. You know, right? So. So before uh, starting the main uh, discussion, OK, so just uh, tell uh, tell me something about yourself so that my viewers can get some sense about you. OK, who are you? Where are you from? Something like that. So give a brief introduction. OK, so first of all, thank you, sir, for uh, giving me this opportunity. So yeah, hello, everyone. My self Sanidhya. Uh, I belong to Madhya Pradesh. Uh, previous year in 2022, I graduated. I, I completed my engineering from electrical background. Uh, after that, I gave my gate examination uh, in 22 and now in 23 also. So uh, after getting my gate score, I'm from general category. After giving, uh, having my gate score, I applied to various IITs and I'm uh, now appearing for different interviews there. Yes. Yeah. Uh, so thank you. So. So one thing I, I want to tell my viewers that uh, Sanidha, Sanidha is from MP already he has uh, mentioned, but uh, Sanidha is under my paid mentorship program. So the most important thing is that about uh, Sanidha, uh, Sanidha actually got shortlisted uh, for three different programs and three different programs at IIT Matras and for uh, got shortlisted for IIT daily also, right? Yes, and, uh, others IITs also and many more IITs. I will not uh, many, I will many make it more lengthy. <laughs> OK, so definitely uh, I hope you will get a uh, seat. OK, and so OK, so the uh, first uh, thing that I want to know from you is that uh, you were uh, shortlisted for uh, which program at IIT uh, Bombay? OK, so talking about IIT Bombay, I was shortlisted uh, as now the COPE shortlisting has not come yet. Uh, the shortlisting of interdisciplinary departments are coming as of now in the month of April and May. So now, as far as now is concerned, I was shortlisted in three departments. First is uh, the CPS department, Center for Public Studies. Second is the Satara department. And third is the IEOR department, Industrial Engineering and Operational Research. Yes. So we will talk about uh, only uh, for uh, MPP program, right? So, okay. uh, so Sanito, can you can you say something about the panelists? Uh, who are the panelists at IIT Bombay for uh, Masters in Public Policy uh, interview, right? Okay. So, shall I first tell about the process? That was the process. Yes, yes, yes. You can you can go for it. Okay. So, talking about like public policy is a emerging area, and the background students are getting to know. Like it has started in very few IITs, I like IIT Delhi, IIT Bombay, and some. Uh, we applied in April month. Uh, we had the application portal, like for all the M Tech branches and other uh, MSRA uh, departments. We applied. Similarly for CPS, we applied. There's a different section for MPP. So after that, uh, many candidates applied, and on the basis of your GATE score the shortlisting is done. So uh, it was mentioned uh, mentioned in the website that they're having 30 seats. They're having 18 sponsored seat and 12 TA seats. It was mentioned, but it is variable. It may change. It is. It just shows in the website. It may change. Right. So, for th so we knew that there were 30 seats. OK, right. so for that, out of uh, all the all those students who were shortlisted, a brief sorting was done and only 61, 61, 62 candidates were selected for the written test. 62 students were selected for the written test. OK, so after written test, uh, it was the first time actually the, this department started in 2019 for IT Bombay. So it is the fourth batch. And this this is the first time they were conducting the interviews and test offline. Every time they used to do the process online since there was COVID pandemic also. OK, so we were called on the campus. Uh, we were having our interview test on 8th of May. And after that, the shortlisting will again be done on the basis of your test. And on the 9th May, we were having our 
interviews so let me first talk about the written test okay. in the written test as i mentioned earlier we are having 61 candidates selected they were from diverse background engineering architecture humanities psychology sociology different background people are there from different background even from uh, there were people who did mba as well very diverse okay. background people were there so uh, the our uh, test uh, started uh, written test it was of 2 hours one hours we were having the basic aptitude test like we were having questions from percentage data interpretation and profit loss comprehension based question the syllabus is same I, i will tell you all the syllabus of test is same just like gate whatever you have prepared in gate that is more than enough to crack if you just revise the notes that would be more than enough to crack so one hour we were having for this in the second part actually in public policy area essay is an important part so for the second part we were having a one hour paper for essay in that we were not given a, uh, any random topic or straight away topic we were given a research paper of two pages uh, that was that was titled for slum areas actually so in that uh, we have to first uh, re- read that paper and we have from that Uh, we have to write an essay the topic was how what is the role of administration we have to be very focused in essay we have to be to the point because if we deviate from the point you will be rejected automatically they will be reading that so it was clearly mentioned that from this research paper and the article which you just read right about the role of the administration in the development of slum areas so this was it this is all about the paper which was held after that in the evening the shortlisting was done it was mentioned that almost everyone will get shortlisted because already there were very less students 61 30 yeah. seats if there are 60 so one is to do was already there but in the evening when the shortlisting came there were only 29 students who got shortlisted for the interview so everyone so most of the half 50% were rejected in the written test okay so i was selected in that written test also i performed well i knew that so by the evening uh, i uh, came to the website and got to know and i was already preparing for the interviews okay so uh, now the next day interview was be uh, were being held there were two panels 15 yes. 15 students were divided approximately in 29 there were two panels each panel were having four professors and all those four professors were from core department uh, like uh, i was in the panel a so in me i had professor vishnu i had uh, Uh, jha sir i had uh, there were two more professor one one uh, who is specializing from ai okay, department so, so one at least uh, uh, there were uh, in a panel so there are four professors as things okay yeah from uh, core faculty right so that's yeah, it so that is fine that is fine so what question they asked uh, in the interview sessions okay so discuss uh, that uh, particular part okay so student will get sense okay b words will get sense okay fine go for it okay so talking about the interview part uh, they were uh, uh, professors are like very chill they were interviewing in a very fun way and they firstly congratulated all of us because it was a very rigorous process you have to be having a high gate score again you have to write a written test and now you are in the third it's just like pre mains and interview in upsc so they came in the morning and congratulated us that all of you have made here i hope all of you will be there in the department as well so first they congratulated and now the process starts so uh, in my panel i had the fourth number so i was allowed to wait outside uh, for my call and as soon as i got the call i went inside i greeted uh, all the professors and i sat down so since this is a public policy department and i am from engineering background so first question Uh, as general they asked that why are you switching from cps background like uh, for from electrical background engineering background to this background so i answered that okay every panel is asking some or more questions there it happened that every every panelist asked question so first question was that after that they they jumped that uh, what are the area of the interest like in every department if you go to the website like in iit bombay there are five theme areas so i told them sir i am having i am having experiences in all the five areas but i told them the two which i like the most so they were like okay fine now the third question which they asked they asked question me from that particular areas as well like what technology 
are you going to use to work in this area since i am from tech background so they are expecting me to give some tech uh, my input from the tech side in the, to this department so they were asking right. like uh, i said two departments the wash and uh, and i said social policy social works uh, like structural inequalities so my the whole interview now uh, again uh, went between both of these after that they asked about my btech project that what my btech project and uh, uh, what uh, what were the applications of that project and the last question actually the meet uh, the interview went for around 25 minutes to 30 minutes and uh, you will not be able to know that how far it is going you will be so in, so involved in the discussion that you will not be able to know that it is going like so fast so yeah. the the last question which were, i was faced was that uh, like uh, if uh, they asked uh, this question I, i think to every candidate that if you if i if we give you a seat in self sponsored category so you will be allowed to stay out of the campus so what will you do you will take it or not so this this are the question five six question which were asked to me and similar question were asked from everyone so you just have to be very well aware from your background how you are going to link it here be very be very clear and yes one more thing that they ask me that tell me a policy tell me a central government policy which you like the most and which you think has solved the issues of the people right okay so since i am from a rural area background i have worked there actually so i knew it so i told them about the policies manirega policy and pm awas right. yojana and sadak yojana i told them all and that is how my interview went and i just came out yes okay so i think uh, this uh... this discussion so okay so you have explained uh, the whole process beautifully i think uh, this uh, discussion will help others also that's why i did not ask many questions okay uh, in between your uh, speech okay so i think this will help uh, the all the students who will appear for the interview of uh, iit delhi and iit tirupati okay there are two more iits okay which are conducting which will uh, conduct interviews and written test uh, for the mpp program okay and this uh, session that discussion will help the others who will appear uh, in the next year also okay so thank you sanida for this uh, discussion and i hope you will do best okay in future and um, that's all okay so thank you guys and that's all from our side and all the best jai hind